here is the final finished product. Slightly cute decorations or drawings are mine. Clearly, this is Marco. I told him to draw a nice truck because my truck <laughs> looks like this. <laughs> so, <laughs> it keeps us just organized and you know, that way we don't double book um, something. So yeah, I got the major dates, nothing too fancy. And usually after I'm done with like little drawings and adding like the main holidays, then I'll go in and add any doctor appointments, uh, class like fitness classes, uh, gym schedules, if I have to go into the office, if Marco has to go into the office, so things like that. What is up guys? <laughs> Good news and bad news. Before I get into this vlog, this holiday vlog, um, I had filmed a short video last weekend, um, more of like a monthly reset, which entailed like financial goals, health goals for the month of December, and how I'm going to be setting myself up for success for the new year. Unfortunately, while I was editing, um, I edit my uh, my videos on Final Cut Pro. So usually like the little screen where I'm editing is like really, really teeny tiny and everything else is like. As I finished editing, I put my video on full screen on my laptop and oh my God, my eyelash was coming off from like the inner corner. Now I, I don't wear lashes often but I was like, you know, I want to I wanna do my hair all cute, wear like a nice little outfit. I feel like usually when I'm vlogging, I'm wearing athletic leisure. But I felt like I actually got dressed up, did my makeup, did my hair, lashes, the whole thing. And I remember when I was filming, I felt like the inner corner kind of like, like when it's lifting and it starts to kind of stab you in the inner corner. Oh, ow! That are in the parking lot going to be like, what the heck is this girl doing? Maybe if I like... That'll kind of help a little bit. It sucks to be short. Unless I move my car. I might have to move my car. Give me a second. That's a lot better, but I'm gonna make this quick because I'm parked up front. So a bunch of the people that I take a class with are gonna start showing up any minute now. So uh yeah, I decided not to upload that film. Only because you can really tell. Like, especially when I'm blinking or looking to the right or left. Like, that little lash is just kind of flying off doing its own thing. I have class in about 15 minutes. So I'm gonna make this really quick. I'm just gonna give like a little sum up of what my goals are for the month of December. It's like two categories of the goals that I wanna focus on. Uh, financial goals and health goals. So the first one, financial goals, and I've got it here on my my little notes app, just to kind of keep me on track. Um, I'm gonna change my contributions. Uh, I don't know if I had mentioned this in a previous video, but I work in finance, and so I'm not gonna give any financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor. Uh, any financial advice, please consult a licensed financial advisor. Okay, moving on. So I'm going to change my 401k to a Roth. I'm trying to convince my brother actually to get a Roth IRA, but my brother is stubborn. Anyway, that's besides the point. So, I'm going to be changing my 401k to Roth. Um, I don't know why it took me so long. I don't think I have an excuse, but changing my contributions for that. Um, I'm also going to calculate my salary for the month, meaning I've got about three paychecks technically for the month of December. And so I'm gonna to total them up. I already know what my bills are and I've have, I have them listed out. And so um, totaling up my bills and my salary, making sure that my bills are always covered first. Even if I if I need to buy like skincare or little things, um, none of that comes first. The first thing is always going to be making sure that my bills are paid. And then if I have anything left over, then if I want to buy skincare or things for the apartment, then I can go ahead and splurge a little bit, but staying within, um, within my means and not going over my budget. Another one is paying off my credit card debt. I don't like to let um, my like I guess like my statement or like my bill roll over until like the next statement so I'm paying off my credit card every month um, I'm usually giving about two to three payments and, and then giving one additional payment to my student loans I'm already giving the minimum to pay off my loans but if I can give at least an additional 
I don't know, 50 bucks, 100 bucks, even if it doesn't make much of a difference, at least I'm making an effort to put a little bit more on top of my regular monthly payment. Starting to build my emergency fund. So in the case, or in the instance that there's an emergency and I have to fly out of um, Texas to California, to Mexico, to wherever, that my bills are covered, um, it's not going to financially hurt me or Marco. I'm not trying to have like my emergency fund done all in a month, but at least getting it started, whether that's only putting down two or $300 set aside just for an emergency on top of like my, my own savings account as well. And then budgeting for groceries. So December is going to be a more expensive month just because it is the holidays. So if I know that Mark, if I know that Marco and I are, are gonna go out to eat with friends or just go out and you know, um, do some holiday stuff together. That means we're gonna have to cook a little bit more at home if we wanna splurge to go out. One thing that I did that has helped um, is cutting back on like my streaming services. Not so much like canceling them, but choosing the, the cheapest plan of like Netflix, Hulu, Disney, um, Peacock, HBO. So all of them, I have ads, which like, I guess, it, it sounds so ridiculous to complain that like I have ads on every streaming service, but I think long run, um, it'll help out, you know, and if I wanna buy that extra latte on the weekend, I can because I'm saving a little bit somewhere else. Um, you know, all within within my means though. Um, health goals, if you guys follow me on TikTok, you've seen that I've been attending Pilates more frequently. Um, I did upgrade my plan, or I'm sorry, my membership, so I can go basically whenever I want. And I'm doing about four to five times a week and at least 8,000 steps a day. I can do 10,000, but I feel like 10,000, it's just gonna put too much pressure on myself to like, I don't know, to just do more than, than what's expected of me, from me. So if I can keep it to at least five to 8,000, I'm good. Another one is um, my diet. Marco and I have been pretty good about trying new vegetables. We're bored of like <laughs> broccoli and carrots after or during every meal. So uh, we're expanding on new vegetables and trying to go to the farmer's market and see which vegetables are in season and incorporating that into our diet. So that's pretty much it. This vlog is going to be a holiday vlog. Um, I have my Pilates class. I'll try to film, but if I can't, um, maybe next time. So after I eat, uh, I'm gonna go pick up Marco, we're gonna go to the mall, do some Christmas shopping, and yeah, I'll just bring you guys along this weekend. Okay, someone parked next to me, so bye. All right, proof that I did it today. Also, you guys, she told me that I was ready to move up to the next level. I'm not gonna lie, today's class was a little intense and I feel like the only reason why I haven't moved up a level is because I, I get humbled. I get humbled in every single of, I can't put my spell on. I get humbled during like every like level one class and I'm still like dying. But she said I was ready. So I think next week I'm gonna try the 1.5 and fingers crossed it goes well. morning vlog it is another day today's Saturday December 9th I had my 9 a.m. Pilates class this morning and I'm not gonna lie that one actually kicked my ass but we are here gonna grab some coffee from our local coffee shop got a couple things to do today I have my friend's birthday dinner um, last night at the mall I did uh, I was able to get Marco's mom's present uh, his brother and I got a couple things for Marco and for myself as well um, and then online I got my goddaughter the play-doh ice cream truck set I, I don't know that's what she wanted so that's what she gets I look I look pretty gnarly um let's go get this coffee get the day started shower eat breakfast and it's gonna be a good day Hold on, hold on. Here's my dilemma. It's about to be four o'clock, or it's already four o'clock. <laughs> my friend's birthday dinner is at eight o'clock tonight. 
Now, getting ready will take me like an hour and a half, maybe two hours, because I need to blow dry and style my hair. But I had the intention of going to uh, find some some clothes for myself, and I don't think I'll have time because we still have to eat something light. Because her, I think her parent, no, her boyfriend's parents are making pozole, so you know, gotta keep an appetite for that. It is 5:51, basically six, and the party is at eight o'clock. I don't have time to find jeans, so I'm just gonna have to wear a regular pair and I'm very very self-aware that I've gained a little bit of weight that's okay it's happy weight <laughs> sweatshirt but we want to make the sweatshirt ignore this cable by the way um we want to make the sweatshirt just like a little shorter so it kind of feels a little more fitting or form fitting for the for the dress so i'm gonna do that little belt trick okay. so i have this um belt that i got um at a thrift store a couple years ago um and it's more for like high-waisted or at least it's smaller so it's fits high-waisted a little better so i think what i saw was you put this belt or a belt just around your waist if i can do it without um and then you essentially just like tuck in your sweatshirt underneath i'm not wearing the right underwear for this but it's black i don't care i mean <laughs> it is what it is so Maybe a little higher and i'll just pair it with cute little earrings um some white sneakers per use and yeah okay i'll be right back okay i removed the little clips um my bangs look better when they were fresh off the roller but or the brush <laughs> but that's okay we're gonna roll with it good morning we are headed off to grab some coffee and a quick little bite we got back at like 1 a.m last night had a lot of fun um i woke up this morning like at 8 9 a.m with the worst period cramps of my life so i couldn't sleep last night am i the only one that gets really bad insomnia on their period <laughs> up a little bit did my brows added a little bit of blush very minimal makeup just to feel a little more put together yeah marco and i went to trader joe's to get a couple of ingredients for the lasagna soup tonight and then we had to go to walmart because they didn't have um like the bigger jugs of uh, olive oil oh my god i did oh my god my hair <laughs> i didn't show the lasagna soup Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I know, it looks it looks funky, but I have a YouTube short where I make this and it just it's so freaking good. I I really should have should have filmed like a uh, like a plate of it 
Oh my gosh, do I always look? I thought I looked a little cuter today. 